Hello beautiful people welcome to my channel in case you are new to my channel, please subscribe and activate the notification button so that you can capture our brand new videos, now let's get right all the way down to business. Fred McGriff became a five-time all-star, three-time silver slugger, and won a World Series with the Atlanta Braves in 1995. In July, he'll be able to call himself a Hall of Famer. McGriff was elected to Cooperstown through the Modern Baseball Technology Committee. He received unanimous assist from the 16 members of the committee produced from Hall contributors, executives and baseball writers. The group included Greg Maddox, who played with McGriff at the Braves, along with Paul Beeston, who was an executive with the Toronto Blue Jays when McGriff made his debut. McGriff were given 169 votes, 39.8%, in his final 12 months at the Baseball Writers Association of America poll in 2019. The Contemporary Technology Committee considers candidates whose careers have been usually from 1980 on. A player needs 75% of the vote to be elected. Known as the crime dog, McGriff hit .284 in his 19-year profession, that ended with the Tampa Bay Devil Rays. He hit 493 home runs and had a 52.6 war. XMLB star Adam LaRoche talks work with military vets after baseball, any regrets from abrupt retirement. He got into the hall over Barry Bonds, Roger Clemens and Kurt Schilling. Bonds and Clemens's careers were tied to the steroid technology, while writers have refused to vote Schilling in over comments he's made in his post-playing profession. Each of the three players fell short in January of their very last possibilities with the BBWAA. Bonds received 66% of the vote, Clemens got 65.2%, and Schilling got 58.6%. Don Mattingly was the subsequent closest to election with eight votes of the 12 required to get into the hall via the committee. Schilling had seven, and Murphy had six. Nobody else had more than three. The Associated Press contributed to this report. Thanks for watching please don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notification button.